All right, for our last value scale then on this worksheet, I want you guys to grab a bunch of your colors. So you're gonna need every color in the rainbow or every color in the color wheel. Um, orange, red, yellow, blue, green, and purple. And of course you can have your white and blender pencil ready to go as well. Uh, for the last value scale, I just want you guys to try to blend all the colors together. So nice and easy. So I'll start with, and you don't have to stay in the boxes for this one, like this box doesn't have to be all yellow. This one isn't all orange, um, clearly because there's not six boxes. It would look kind of weird. Plus we want to show blending. So um, I'm just going to start with like the blend happens in between each box. So for me, like this is my orange box and I want to make it super dark. I'm going to go lighter and then kind of overlap that yellow box. The yellow is my lightest color, so I'm gonna have a little bit more pressure as it goes into the orange. And I can use that lightest color as my blender again, so I could use the yellow, I could use a white pencil, or I could use the colorless pencil, whatever works for you. So I have my first one done. Then I'm gonna go orange into red. And it, the blend doesn't always have to happen like right at the crack of the, or the line dividing, that's okay too. We have a few extra boxes. If you don't fill all the boxes, it's fine. Don't panic. This time my orange is my lighter color, so I'm gonna use that as the blender. If you wanna start with a different color on the end, that's totally fine too. As long as you go in color wheel order, it's fine. Add a little bit more red, perfect. Now I'm gonna start going pretty light because I want my red to go into my next color, which is purple. Everyone's gonna have a little bit different purple in their box. So I have a really light purple. Some of the purples are really dark. I should say a majority of the purples are really dark. So my purple here is my lighter color. Usually it would be, purple would be my darker color. It just depends which one you have in your box. Same with some of you have sky blues and some of you have like really dark blues in your boxes. I'm gonna use that purple again as my blender since it's just so much lighter than the blue. And very last, I'm gonna have green. And both my blue and green are pretty light, so, but I think the blue is just a little bit darker, so I am gonna use the green as my blender pencil here. And if you have an extra box, you could like go back and start back over at the color wheel or you can just end it. I'm fine with that. As long as you made it through all the colors. So I could go back and add another yellow box here. And that is the worksheet. So you should have, when you're done, 
I did this one wrong. Um, you should have one color just using pressure. The color that you used up top should also use then just black and white to make values. And then the very last one, we are gonna do a rainbow color wheel all blended together. So if you have any questions, please let me know and I will talk to you guys soon, bye.